In recent months, there has been an escalating trend of users recognizing the dumbing and slowing down of ChatGPT, so much so that there has been discontent among Twitter and Reddit users, as well as coders and engineers alike, regarding the oh-so-famous AI system. Stanford University has recently published a report addressing the mounting concerns, after users complained that ChatGPT's performance has taken a significant hit. This has resulted in a widespread decline in satisfaction with the AI system. But what possibly could be causing this supercomputer AI brain to start becoming dumber? Well, in this video we will explore the findings of Stanford's investigation, explore the possible reasons behind ChatGPT's diminishing capabilities, and find out if AI is becoming more like humans than we know. Stanford's report highlights several disconcerting trends about the AI that have emerged since March. One of the most noticeable issues is ChatGPT's diminishing ability to provide top-notch answers. Okay, here we go. What color is a fire truck? Oh, oh God, I always get these. Um, okay, uh, all right, fire truck. Fire truck, fire truck, fire truck, fire truck. What color are those red fire trucks? Uh... Oh God, I can... Reddit users initially reported that ChatGPT was getting dumber, which became more evident through the slower response times and reduced accuracy in its answers. Upon further investigation, Stanford researchers discovered that the latest version, GPT-4, has experienced a drastic decline in its performance over the past three months. A striking example of ChatGPT's declining performance lies in its code generation capabilities. In March, GPT-4 was able to generate correct code approximately 52% of the time. However, recent data indicates that this rate has plummeted to a mere 10%. This significant drop in code generation proficiency is a cause for concern among the coding community, further adding to the growing discontent with ChatGPT. Stanford's findings reveal distressing declines in crucial areas of ChatGPT's abilities. The AEI's comprehension of mathematics has plunged by a staggering 95% which greatly affects its usefulness in solving math-related queries. Additionally, ChatGPT's once strong common sense and reasoning skills have significantly diminished, raising serious doubts about its reliability. As researchers delve into ChatGPT's performance decline, they have noted an intriguing trend, the AI has become safer but less rational. While the emphasis on safety is commendable, the trade-off with a decrease in rationality raises concerns about the overall effectiveness of ChatGPT as a reliable source of information and assistance. There's a rabbit stuck in a tree, and I want to return that rabbit to the wild so it can lay its eggs. With the root cause of ChatGPT's decline becoming a topic of discussion, speculation has emerged about OpenAI's potential motivations. Drawing parallels with past incidents in the tech industry, some users are questioning whether OpenAI is intentionally dumbing down ChatGPT to achieve certain goals. There have been comparisons to Apple's past 2020 controversy. In 2020, Apple faced a lawsuit for allegedly slowing down iPhone batteries to compel customers to purchase newer models. Similarly, users are suggesting that OpenAI may may have something to gain by limiting ChatGPT's capabilities. The more ChatGPT Plus subscriptions they sell, the more users share its processing power. By subtly reducing each account's computational demands, OpenAI could potentially increase their subscription sales and maximize profits. Another plausible explanation for ChatGPT's decline could be linked to the ongoing AI chip crisis, leading OpenAI to cut costs and conserve computational resources. Until the crisis abates, it's possible that the company may be adopting a penny-pinching approach, which inadvertently affects the quality of the service. No more refills! <laughs> Give me back them toys and freeloaders! Show's over, cheapskate! <laughs> Hey, it's my lucky day! A penny! Your luck just ran out! Another theory that has emerged among AI enthusiasts and experts are speculations that user behaviors may be contributing to the AI system's quote, dumbing down over time. This primarily deals with the feedback loop of inaccurate prompts and replies. As ChatGPT learns from its interactions with users, it relies on its vast datasets to understand language and provide relevant responses. However, the AI is not immune to the feedback it receives from its users. If users consistently input inaccurate, misleading, or dumb prompts, ChatGPT's learning model may start adapting to this limited and sometimes erroneous information. 
Is mayonnaise an instrument? This theory suggests that as users repeatedly provide less accurate or incomplete prompts and replies, ChatGPT's knowledge base becomes progressively restricted. In essence, the AI system starts adapting to the collective dumbness of its users by basing its responses on the patterns of the data it receives most frequently. Nope, it's not Ashton Kutcher, it's Kevin Malone. Equally handsome, equally smart. If this speculation holds true, it could lead to a self-perpetuating cycle of diminishing performance. As ChatGPT adapts to the limited knowledge presented by users, it may become less capable of providing nuanced and accurate responses, reinforcing users' dissatisfaction and potentially leading to a further decline in the quality of interactions. OpenAI should actively counteract potential negative influences on ChatGPT's learning process. As the AI community delves deeper into this speculation, it becomes evident that striking a balance between user input and system oversight is vital for the optimal functioning of ChatGPT. OpenAI must explore ways to mitigate the impact of biased or limited user feedback on the AI's learning process. Regular updates to the training data and refining the model's algorithms could be essential steps in countering this self-perpetuating cycle of decline. In conclusion, Stanford's report serves as a crucial wake-up call for OpenAI to address the declining performance of ChatGPT. Whether OpenAI is intentionally dumbing down ChatGPT to boost subscription sales, or trying to cope with the AI chip crisis, or maybe users' behavior might inadvertently be contributing to the AI's diminishing intelligence. Until OpenAI shares more insights into the situation, the true reasons behind ChatGPT's downturn remain speculative, leaving users in the dark about the AI system's future. Thank you for joining us on this exploration into the concerning decline of ChatGPT's performance. We hope this discussion has sparked your curiosity and given you valuable insights into the complexities of AI systems. We want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on the factors that may be contributing to the AI's slowdown? Leave a comment below and let us know your perspective. If you enjoyed this video and found it informative, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Mind Muscle TV, for more thought-provoking content on the latest developments in AI and beyond. Also, show your support by hitting that like button and checking out our other engaging videos linked on the screen right now. Until the next time, and as always, stay curious.